Imagine this scenario you're at a cafe, having a sip of coffee and scrolling your cell phone when you feel the captivating gaze of a woman watching you. What's your next move? Welcome to Mind Mysteries, where we delve into the ins and outs of relationships, seduction, and self-improvement. Today, let's delve into a particularly intriguing subject, how to respond when you notice a woman watching you. It's a situation many of us have experienced more often than we realize, and navigating it with finesse isn't always straightforward. As we know, eye contact is a potent tool in flirting and a vital form of non-verbal communication. It can signify interest or just passing curiosity, but interpreting it correctly can significantly alter subsequent interactions. Of course, context matters, but when you're self-assured and know how to react, you can influence the atmosphere to your advantage, creating an ideal setting for potential connections to flourish. Countless relationships begin with a mere glance, that initial eye contact that ignites something more profound. When we spot someone we're drawn to, we seek mutual eye contact, a silent acknowledgement that can initiate a deeper bond. This exchange of glances is akin to a wordless dance, where each interaction can amplify mutual interest and curiosity, conveying more than words ever could. Sustaining eye contact not only demonstrates interest but also communicates confidence and assurance, signaling, I'm here and interested in you without uttering a word. Furthermore, maintaining eye contact is a potent means of demonstrating engagement and presence. A steady, confident gaze not only expresses interest but also exudes confidence, asserting, I'm interested and secure in this moment without the need for verbal affirmation. It's a subtle invitation, inviting the other person to approach or engage in further interaction. In today's discussion, we'll explore some nuances of this intricate dance of gazes. We'll learn how to interpret them and respond appropriately. This understanding can be pivotal, not only in avoiding missteps but also in unlocking new possibilities. Let's delve into what to do and what to avoid when you find yourself in this scenario. Before we proceed, don't forget to show your support by hitting the like button, enabling us to continue sharing valuable insights like this. Are you ready? Let's dive in. Part 1. What to Avoid Let's begin by identifying common mistakes that can sabotage your chances before a conversation even starts. By recognizing and avoiding these pitfalls, you can ensure you're presenting yourself in the best possible light when someone catches your eye. Mistake 1. Ignoring or looking away One of the most prevalent errors in flirting is disregarding or diverting your gaze when you notice someone watching you. This behavior can be interpreted as disinterest or apprehension, particularly if you're intrigued. In public settings like cafes or bookstores, resisting the urge to avert your gaze is crucial. Failing to maintain eye contact not only overlooks a potential connection but also obscures your interest. When you fail to meet their gaze, you miss the opportunity to convey approachability and openness, potentially deterring further interaction. Mistake 2. Insecure gestures such as repeated nodding Another common misstep is displaying insecurity through gestures like incessant nodding. When someone attempts to establish continuous visual contact, responding solely with nods can signal submission or excessive nervousness. Such gestures not only appear insecure but also suggest a lack of confidence, which is unappealing in the realm of flirting. This behavior may lead them to perceive you differently, potentially viewing you as uncertain or lacking self-assurance, rather than an intriguing potential partner. Mistake 3. Letting Ego Hinder Initiative Lastly, allowing your ego to hinder initiative is a prevalent mistake in flirting. Many individuals, out of pride or fear of rejection, wait for the other person to make the first move. However, this can impede the development of a potential connection. Proactivity is attractive and demonstrates confidence, a desirable trait in romantic encounters. Hesitation or reluctance to take initiative can be perceived as disinterest or indecisiveness, diminishing your chances of advancing the interaction. It's essential to demonstrate your engagement and willingness to lead a conversation or relationship, rather than passively waiting for the other person to act. Part 2 How to Act Appropriately Now that we've identified potential pitfalls, let's explore how to respond effectively in such situations. By adopting these strategies, you can make a positive impression and enhance the likelihood of a favorable outcome. Action 1. Maintain eye contact and smile. When you notice someone watching you, a favorable response is to sustain eye contact momentarily. This simple yet impactful gesture communicates confidence and interest, establishing an immediate connection. By maintaining eye contact, you demonstrate comfort and receptiveness to further interaction. Additionally, complimenting eye contact with a genuine smile can alleviate any initial tension, fostering a relaxed and inviting atmosphere conducive to flirting. A smile can serve as an invitation, encouraging the other person to initiate a conversation or approach you. Action 2 Project Confidence While Remaining Authentic While confidence is crucial, it's essential to remain authentic in your demeanor. 
Avoid exaggerating gestures or adopting a persona that doesn't align with your true self. A composed posture and natural gestures convey assurance and facilitate genuine interaction. Authenticity is appealing and fosters a deeper connection, so prioritize being yourself rather than attempting to impress. By embracing authenticity, you increase the likelihood of the other person feeling comfortable and drawn to your genuine essence. Action 3. Take initiative respectfully. When mutual interest is apparent, it's essential to take the initiative respectfully. Approach the interaction with an open posture and a friendly demeanor, introducing yourself clearly and initiating light conversation. This approach demonstrates confidence and interest while respecting the other person's boundaries and comfort. In casual settings like cafes, initiating conversation about shared surroundings or interests can establish a foundation for further interaction. By engaging in meaningful dialogue, you create opportunities for deeper connection and mutual understanding. In conclusion, being watched by someone presents a unique opportunity to form a connection. Each exchange glance holds the potential for a meaningful encounter, provided you navigate it with confidence and authenticity. By avoiding common mistakes and adopting appropriate actions, you can enhance your chances of establishing a genuine connection. Apply these insights in your interactions and observe how they positively impact your social encounters. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more valuable content. Thank you for watching though.